Happy December! This is the month of Christmas, the season of giving, the most wonderful time of the year. And that's why the theme this month in Sidekick to Hero is be a go-giver. We're going to talk about how to give like a hero and how that old adage that goes, it's better to give than to receive, is totally true. And we'll start in today's message for Monday, a useful message for teens in four minutes or less. This time of year is super important to many people because it's the time that millions of people, including myself, celebrate the birth of Jesus Christ. But Christmas is for everyone, even non-religious people, because it's the time of year that we focus on giving things to other people, which means that it's the time of year that we get things from other people, which is totally fun and awesome. Yet there is a danger to the season that is always explored in every holiday movie. A warning that is always heralded in every Christmas song. And that message is, don't focus on getting so much, you big greedy babies. But even with those warnings in the songs and the movies, sometimes we can get lost in really focusing on receiving all the cool things and we don't focus so much on the giving. But I want all of us this month to focus on not just being a giver, but being a go-giver. That's a play on the phrase being a go-getter, which describes someone who takes action to get what they want, which I also totally love, but that's not the theme this month. I like that phrase being a go-giver because it implies that we're not just giving, but we're really putting action and energy into our giving. Also the phrase go-giver is from the best-selling business book by Bob Berg and John David Mann, where they tell a story that showcases what they call the five laws of stratospheric success. This month, I wanna take their work and combine it with the idea of giving around the holidays to help all of us give more like a hero this season. And the first place we're gonna start is giving more than you get this year. Do you think that's even possible? Like as a teen, to, to give more than you're gonna get? I mean, chances are you don't have as much money as your parents have, and they're the ones who are gonna be giving you most of your presents this year. Well, them and Santa. So how can you give more than you're gonna get? I don't know, at least not specifically for you. That's for you to figure out. But I do know in the book, The Go-Giver, the first law of stratospheric success is your true worth is determined by how much more you give in value than you take in payment. Now, I'm gonna change that a little bit for Christmas to your true holiday enjoyment is determined by how much more you give than you get for Christmas. What if your goal was to give more than you get this year? How would that change your life? How would that change your approach to this season? Bob Berg, John David Mann, and myself would say, it's gonna increase the value that you get out of the holidays. Now, giving more than you get doesn't just have to involve the cost of everything. Like, shoot, my brother gave me $15 worth of Pokemon cards, now I gotta give him 20. There are so many more important things out there than money. We're gonna start this month's theme by focusing less on the list of things that you want and more on the list of things that you can give. I want your brain to get cracking on a list of things that you can give your family, your friends, and the people in the world around you. This can be giving more of your time, giving more in conversations, giving more in service, giving more in forgiveness or kindness that you might get from others. The options are really only limited by your creativity. This December, let's all be go-givers. It's really the secret to more success in our lives, especially in our relationship with others. <laughs> Our Christmas virtual hangout is this week, this Thursday at 5 p.m. Pacific, 6 p.m. Mountain, 7 p.m. Central, and 8 p.m. Eastern. I did it. It's at the usual time. Now, remember, this is a Christmas movie watch party. You're going to need an Amazon Prime account in order to participate. You can even sign up for a free trial, and I hear that will work. Make sure you have all the tech stuff worked out ahead of time before we start because the movie's going to start on time. We're all going to log in to Amazon and we're going to be able to chat with each other during the movie. Remember, we'll be watching Candy Cane Lane on Amazon Prime starring Eddie Murphy. Make sure you get it approved by your parents if you need to. And make sure you wear your holiday pajamas or just any pajamas if you got them. And make sure you make your favorite holiday treat. I know for me, I'll be making peppermint muddy buddies. It's going to be a great time. Again, make sure you work out all 
the tech stuff ahead of time so you don't miss out. I hope to see you guys there. Bye!